where did you find the the style that I kind of mentioned of sort of sitting with your actors and sitting with them? I mean, just right from the top of the film when we're in the car, it's very much about watching this person exist within the world until something happens around them. Where did you where did you find that going into this? Uh, that's a good question. I mean, I think, you know. Thanks. Uh, you know, I, 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 I think in trying to find out what kind of filmmaker I was, this, you know, I, I made a couple of short films, and I think, you know, out of those shorts, a, a style was being formed. Um, you know, I, I was, I had done a couple little short docs, you know, between documentary, and I like that line between documentary and fiction, and and what's real and what's not, and. And so I wanted to keep a lot of that same approach here and let things sort of breathe and, and, and unfold. Um, it's just something that I've learned over the last couple of years of going to film school and you know my personal taste and one of the things that I kind of like. Um, and it kind of, it's evolving organically uh, is probably the best answer I can, I can give. Um, you know, I think there is that sort of doc feel uh, to the film. Uh, but I didn't want the film to be a documentary. I wanted to f to be elevated. How do I elevate sort of the the things that I love about a documentary? The the good thing about fiction is that you can change your fate. Uh, you know, sometimes if a documentary is so true, it's just it, it is what it is. You know, and here we can we can show. You know, we can we can play with it a little bit, and we can we can change that narrative. Um, we have the ability to do that. Um, so I just wanted to keep that truth and and you know that stillness. Some of the qu most quiet scenes in the film are the loudest, um, and and there's something very powerful about silence. Um, and I think, you know, when you watch the film and you, and, you, and you have those moments of just reflecting or a character can just sit there, I think that's the most, it's some of the most powerful stuff you can watch. Yeah, there's something very observational about your approach to the, to the story here. You feel like a, I wouldn't say a detached observer, but a somewhat removed observer rather than really uh, punctuating and, and pushing what we're supposed to hear and see. 